Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to be unboxing and checking out the ANET A8 3D desktop printer from GearBest. Now this thing is actually on sale right now for about $160 USD and that is actually a really compelling price to buy this thing but I got it early on so let's check it out and see what's really inside of here. Now this printer is a DIY version so you have to assemble it yourself of course and that's why the price point is so cheap. But how hard is it and is it worth it? Well, let's find out. Alright, all right, so we got the box and uh, there is tape all around it. So let's take it apart. Actually, it's upside down, so I made a mistake right there. There's actually a top cover. And there we go. Now there is a ton of stuff right here. Ton of screws, ton of nuts and bolts. This is just insane, but if you're the type of person like me who likes doing DIY kind of stuff, this is probably for you. Again, an absurd amount of stuff. Um, seems like we have some PLA 10 meter long um, material right here. So it does come with a starter kit, a bunch of assembly parts, and more assembly parts, aluminum pieces, probably the base right here. That's pretty nice. It even comes with the tools that you need to assemble this thing. Um, let's see what's under. Now I actually don't know if I'm going to be able to make a how-to video on how to assemble this thing, but there is a very long tutorial online on YouTube and on the website on how to put it together. The next layer is, of course, more stuff. Um, let's take a look here. Seems like we have the board, the actual logic board, a USB micro SD card uh, reader, probably for some stuff, a bunch of rails, cables, more cables, um, more of the frame right here. And finally, even more stuff. Check that out. So we got the motors right here. We got one, two, three, four motors, and uh, more rails, more cables, and just a ton of stuff here that you're gonna have to put together yourself. But um, this is probably gonna keep me busy for a quite a while to put this together. So that is actually pretty much it for this unboxing. This is just to see what it quickly looks like on the inside. So let's take a look over here. It seems like this is actually the power supply that powers everything. It looks pretty solid. Um, it doesn't look cheap at least, so that's good. So yep, that is quite a lot of stuff here to uh, put together. But it's going to be quite an adventurous assembly build. But yeah guys, that is pretty much it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this and uh, found this helpful. Letting you know guys what this is going to look like when you get it. If you're going to buy it. Again, it is 160 USD, so it is actually really, really cheap for what it is, once it is assembled. How good is it? How does it perform? And how bad is assembly? Well, we're going to find out in the next video when I get to put together this thing. I'm going to try to vlog it somehow. But yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed this and found it helpful. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully, this won't take me too long. But yeah. Take care, everyone.